Hi guys, it's a nice sunny day today and I'm just going to revisit this wind driven car that I did because I've had a comment from Project of Games that I should fix the fan on the back of the car so it blows the car along. So I've made a styrofoam mounting for it. First of all we'll demonstrate it. We just blow some air on it and away it goes. Now I'll bring it back and put the fan straight on the back of the car. All right. Fan on the back of the car. Oh, we are getting some movement. But it's not going as fast as it was before. Now the first question some people will ask is why is it moving at all? Because if we start talking about Newton's laws of it, energy conservation or whatever, number three, every action gives an equal and opposite reaction. Well, what should be happening there is the fan is blowing that way and the plate is catching that wind and should be pushing forwards but at the same time the fan is blowing that way which means the fan itself is trying to go this way so we should have equal and opposite cancelling each other out so it shouldn't move at all if I take the plate out the way and then switch the fan on it goes the other way entirely because the wind is being pushed that way I like this demonstration it's a good example of how theory and practice don't necessarily match. The theory is the plate is trying to push the car forwards and the fan is trying to push the car backwards and they should cancel each other out. But because the air is able to escape from the side of the plate and comes out at an angle it's still pushing the car forwards but we take the plate out the way the fan is blowing the car in the opposite direction so I hope that helps